evening, ladies and gentlemen. We, the class of 2014, stand before you after a long, long road that started 12 years ago. I, uh, my name is Nervous, and I'm really Andrew. Oh. Uh, uh. Next, we'll hear from Yu Lei Li, valedictorian for the International Baccalaureate School. <coughs> Students. Graduates, faculty, invigilators, parents, grandparents, and old people who just come to these things. Good evening and congratulations, class of 2014. Thank you. And now the valedictorian for Summerlin Academy, Krishan Raja Rundan. Thank you, Sergeant Harris. Four score and 1,300 days ago, or three years, nine months, 11 days ago, or 33,120 hours ago, or 119 and 32,000 seconds ago, our freshman selves advanced towards a new chapter of our complex lives. As you can probably tell, I've really been counting the months, days, hours, and even seconds that it would take for this moment to finally arrive. I've really been dreading this end of the remarkable chapter of our lives as well. Now, we are engaged in a rite of passage, a bittersweet ending to a turbulent, unpredictable, enlightening, enjoyable, and <laughs> supercalifragilisticexpialidocious, for lack of a better word, era of our lives. But rather than only looking back at the remarkable years, months, and days behind us, that filled our hearts with strong memories, we can look ahead towards a promising future that may forge even stronger memories. What we often overlook, however, is that we are the ones that make that future. Our dreams and aspirations shall manifest, rippling throughout the decades and centuries that lie ahead. Even our small actions will affect the coming times, especially in the small scale of mere seconds. Now, you may think that something as tiny or insignificant as a second cannot have much of an impact on the future. But after all, what is a century but 3 billion 155 million seconds? We made it through high school, emerged victoriously, and we can certainly relax this summer. But soon, it will be time for us to climb the walls that will obstruct our plans and goals, to change the entire earth for the better, to inspire and be inspired by the infinite number of people and experiences that await us. But as we embark on the imminent adventures that will last the rest of our lives, we mustn't forget to acknowledge the care, inspiration, and wisdom of the teachers, parents, custodians, guidance counselors, fellow pupils, and others, which without, we would have never been able to walk, both literally and figuratively. We shall remember these essential contributions from the past that have made our present possible and our futures limitless. Tonight, we mark the commencement of our adult lives to celebrate the times behind us and in the present, but then for the future. And now, I hope I did not waste 180 seconds of your time. Thank you.